too rock and roll though, is it? How's this sound, little rock and roll? Say, playing with my new toy. Well, this isn't new, but the amp's new. Hopefully, uh, didn't burn your eardrums too much. Let me set that down, turn this off, and welcome everyone back to another episode of Beers, Bands, and Guitars with Barnes. Picked up my Marshall amp today, figured why not pull out the old strat and uh, give her a few. Uh, Strums. I know it probably didn't sound too good, but goddamn was it loud and it felt awesome. So, hope you enjoyed it. And I apologize, I'm looking at my camera now, it's going to be dark and I am not doing this again. So, let's get to the uh, beer review. Today, I'm going to review Fiddlehead IPA. This is another IPA from Vermont. My uh, neighbor Karen down the street dropped this off for me. And speaking of my neighbor Karen, later on today, if you guys are all free, go check out Sweeney's around 640. Her son's band's playing. They're called The Rook. They were practicing earlier today in their garage. Sound pretty good. So if you can, get out to Sweeney's and uh, show them some support. Trust me, they're going to sound a lot better than I did. So you got that going for you. So let's get this uh, review underway and see how this is tasting. Crack that open. Uh, give her the old pour. Look at that. Now that's a pour. Look at that. Let's get up there close. You see that? Look how good that is. I'm going to turn some light on too so we can see. I don't know. All right. Well, let's see how the beer tastes. Cheers. Not bad. It's actually a little rougher than I would like. You definitely taste the hops. They kind of like, uh, they, to be honest with you, they're kind of overbearing. But it's smooth going down. It comes in at, what's the alcohol content on this? Oh, 6.2%, so it has a little bit of a kick. Ah, all in all. I think I've had better. I'm going to give it a 7.1. It's a solid IPA. All you IPA fans out there, if you're up in Vermont, grab yourself a four-pack of the Fiddlehead IPA. You'll enjoy it. So, I'll leave you with that. And like I said, go if you can, get the Sweeney's, check out the uh, Rook play, and we'll see you all next week. Have a good one.